Alright, welcome. Welcome back to the channel. So this is some cool stuff. I just finally came in the mail. I've been waiting for a while on these. So if you want to check out some cool military toys, here we go. I got some reinforcements here. I got some new vehicles. This is going to be fun. Alright, so let's see what we got. Well, first off, in this video, we are going to be unboxing the M113. Let's move these guys out of the way. And check this out. We got an M113 Desert Armored Vehicle. One of my uh, favorite uh, military vehicles I've ever seen in terms of the overall look of it. And as far as the toy is concerned, it looks like it's got some neat little features, so let's get the, let's get this opened up and oh yeah, and that soldier looks really cool too. Oh, this is gonna go so good with my GI Joes. Now, how do I open this? Oh, check out the back of the box real quick. Apparently, this brand has an up armored Humvee. We got a Spec Ops. Army Strike Helicopter, they got a Navy SEAL Warfare Gunboat. They're showing some of the soldiers up there that you can get. They got a Desert Force Attack Vehicle down there. But what we're here to look at is this bad boy. Alright. No more stalling, let's open them up. Wow. Hopefully I do this right. Free you from your cardboard prison, so you can wage war on the forces of evil and save the world from the evil cobra. Come on. Oh, I'm ruining the box, aren't I? Eh, I do that every episode. There we go. Open you up. Let's see what awesome, what this awesome vehicle is like in hand, in person. There we go. Okay, let's toss the box off to the side. Let's see here. There's our M113. Nice. It's closer than I thought it would be, too. Alright, let's get it out. Gotta get it out of the plastic now, the plastic packaging. There we go. There it is. I think there might be a little bit of assembly with this thing. So let's see here. Um, yeah, I think we have to put some weapons on it. All right. But before we do that, oh, there we go. It opens right up. You can put a guy in the, and right in there. The guy in the driver's seat. Oh, there he goes. There's our soldier. Let's see, he might be a little stiff, because I just got him. He just came out of the packaging. Let's see if we can adjust his arms a little bit and get him right there in the driver's seat. And this part even... Oh, wow. This churns, too, like a turret. Makes sense. I think you put one of the machine guns on here, too. Yeah, so that would make sense. Oh, we got a cool helmet for him. Check that out. All right, let's get that little helmet out. All right, you need your crew helmet. If you're gonna be riding around in a tank, you're probably gonna want your helmet. Come on. All right, let's get this helmet on him. There we go. Back in the tank. Well, okay, yes, I know it's not a tank. It's a armored personnel carrier, but you know, Okay, what do we got here? We got some weapons. We got some backpacks. Let's get these weapons out first. And then we gotta get the backpacks out once we get the weapons out. There's that weapon, there's an ammo box, I think. Yeah, I think that's an ammo box. And we got these backpacks to take out. There we go. Come on, backpack. Back, 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 
Okay, so it doesn't look like the backpacks can be worn by the soldier, but they're meant to go on the vehicle. And I think you attach them like that. There's one. There's two. And there should be a slot for the third backpack right here. There we go. Come on, go in there, right? Right? There we go. We got our backpacks so they can carry supplies with them. Now, one of these guns, I believe, snaps in here. I, I think you can do it with either one. Although, I'll, I think there's two different spots for guns here. Now, one of these guns might have this ammo clip attached to it. I'm looking. I'm looking to see if this ammo clip is supposed to attach to one of these guns somehow. Well, I think it goes on this one. Yeah, you see there's a little slot there. That you're supposed to get this in. There we go. Come on. Yeah, so this is a removable ammo. Uh... A removable magazine. Now let's just figure out where to, which gun goes where. I'm not sure it really matters, but you can attach one in the back and one in the front. I'm gonna put the uh, this one back there, and then put this one up here. There we go. How's that look? We got one of the machine guns back there. We got the other machine gun up here on the turret. The turret can rotate. That's cool. Now, the back. From the pictures I saw, you're supposed to be able to open this up. There we go. You can open the hatch back there to put soldiers and supplies in. And then you can open this hatch to put more soldiers and supplies in. And you can fill it up with men, weapons, whatever you need to carry. Supplies, medical supplies. And your soldiers will be thankful for it. Alright. Pretty cool, huh? Neat vehicle. I think, you know, I've wanted this M113 for a while. <laughs> Funny story, I actually had ordered it a long time ago, but had to cancel the order. So I ended up um, ordering it again not so long ago so I could finally have it. And that time, this time, obviously, I didn't cancel the order. Because I've wanted this for a while. This is nice. And it'll go very well with G.I. Joe's and other army toys. You know, we get a couple other soldiers out here. Hold on a sec. I want to give them some weapons. Put a couple more soldiers. Let's get another soldier out here. Yeah, it'll go good with other soldiers too. Nice little vehicle. I don't know, there's something about this vehicle I really like. Part of it might be I played the uh, Arma, th Arma 2 and Arma 3, and this vehicle is in Arma 2, plus there's mods for it in Arma 3. And it just, it's a neat vehicle in the game, and it's a neat vehicle as a toy, and it's a neat vehicle for real, so. Happy to have it. Okay, so if you enjoyed watching this, please subscribe, leave a comment, let me know what you think. I did another video where I did a review on our war, World War II Germans, the, the uh, rifleman and the machine gunner, and this is my review on... Yeah, I, I, I really like this thing. This is cool. I recommend it, that's for sure. Alright, see you around. Thank you for watching, and... I couldn't think of anything cool to say, so... Yeah. It's a cool vehicle. If you like the video, please let me know. And if... Hey, if you want to get one of these, I think they still have them on Amazon. Uh... Oh, there wasn't many left in stock when I bought it. That doesn't mean they won't get more. Alright. Fun. Alright, see you around.